Hey everyone, today I want to talk about human potential and diet and lifestyle. I met a lady when I was coming up here cycling, Brayhead, Ireland, and I just wanted to say, like my hero said, humans are hardly reaching their potential. And I said, if you're not eating a raw vegan diet, especially if you're not eating a vegan diet, a healthy vegan diet, i.e. if you're eating like dairy, fish, eggs, cheese, ice cream, basically any meat or animal products whatsoever, you are, you're basically slowly killing yourself. You're committing suicide slowly as some people say and that, that may sound severe, but how many people do you know who have died in their 20s, 30s, 40s, 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s even, prematurely from cancer, heart attack, diabetes, stroke, beautiful forest head, etc, etc, etc. All these diseases that never existed, hardly ever existed a very long time ago. They all came in with processed food and we started eating a whole lot of poor quality crap food, crap and processed meats and stuff and dairy after the World War II. But even before World War II, it was like very adulterated, terrible, it's become pretty terrible. So I think it's terrible basically and I'm just, I'm not judging on the deepest level, and deepest level all as well, but I'm talking about the, the superficial, worldly, human, grounded, serious, proper, ordinary, real level. You know, if you, if you break your leg, you can say, oh, it's just an illusion, but like, come on, I'm just trying to be serious here, like, with the grounded spirituality. I want people to get serious about their health. I want them to take responsibility. I want people to take responsibility in relationships and in their life, and about their health, and about where they're going forward in life. And think about your families. Do you know another thing that eating non-vegan food does? It, it congests you, so it helps plaque your system. Congest your arteries and veins. It gives you erectile dysfunction if you're a man. That's terrible, and that's what basically what heart attack and stroke is too. It's a blood clot or a clot in your arteries, or your veins. How much fun is that? So I highly, highly recommend a raw vegan diet, 100% raw, or as much raw as you want, healthy vegan food, as least from packages, cans, tins, etc. as possible, as much proper whole, real quality fruits, vegetables. <sighs> Beautiful. So I'm really happy today making this video for you, I have to say. Feeling in a great mood today. High vibrational, higher than usual for definite. Feeling awesome, to be honest. I feel so good, it's hard to explain. And it's funny, because uh, spirituality, the shadow in spirituality, so often are we hiding and avoiding real topics like rape, murder, torture, slavery. And they, they occur in wars and human to humans. It's horrible, it's sad. And it also occurs in needless factory farming and exploitation usage, slaughter, torture of animals for our needless consumption. We don't need them at all. The people tricked us, the dairy industry, the pharmaceutical industry, the and the meat industry, they all work together. They tell lies that we need the calcium, all that stuff. When in fact, that milk is breast milk from a, a given birth cow. It's gross to be drinking milk, horrible. It's like seriously gross on a rational level. It's insane. You may as well be drinking rat milk or whatever, wildebeest milk, uh, dog milk, cat milk. But we go for the cows because they store a lot of milk. It's just crazy to be honest. No offense, no judgment up there. It's very acidifying. So they lie to make money and then we get sick, we get erectile dysfunction. We get Alzheimer's, diabetes, heart attack, stroke. We die young, we leave our family, and we have crap or shit health. No fun. <laughs>